The connection to the car culture continues north on Woodward at the Cranbrook Complex of Schools and Museums. James Scripps Booth, the son of the founders, considered a car a work of art. He designed cars that were ahead of their time. They were both beautiful and full of innovations, like horn buttons, spare tires, and Detroit's first V8 engine. His parents, wealthy newspaper owners George and Ellen Booth, had built a home here in 1904. Originally a country house in what was farmland in Bloomfield Hills, the Booths left Detroit and moved in permanently in 1908. They eventually shifted their focus from running their news operations and established an educational community with an emphasis on the arts and science. George Booth tapped Eli Saarinen, his son's professor of architecture at the University of Michigan, to help create the Cranbrook Academy. Saarinen's design influence is seen everywhere on the ground. Its science museum, art museum, and in its buildings. This is a place to enjoy the scenery and the art in an idyllic setting. Cranbrook is the perfect way to end a great drive along Woodward Avenue.